are here at our locals. We came, we had the regional yesterday. We came back, we were gassed. We just needed to get home, we were tired. But we are here at the locals and there was one deck profile that we didn't get yet. And it was, of course, our own knight, Chris Ledger. Prophet, as you know, yeah. he took eighth place at the regional. Top eight made an invite to the WCQ. Yep. So he got the invite. We're super proud of him. Congratulations, Chris. Thanks Congratulations, so Prophet. Yeah, dude. Super proud of you, man. How did the event go, man? Um, it was really good. I was 4-0 by round five, and then I played the, one of my, in my opinion, one of the best players I've played. And um, it was Rufus. He kept second. Oh, okay. This regional. Uh, okay. He completely decimated me in the mirror match. Oh, so he played Sword Soul this he played time. Sword Soul this time. Oh, okay. He taught me some really valuable stuff. And okay. Then I played another guy, Spencer. You'll see his profile too. Um, I just played really poorly against him and didn't see a lot of stuff. DP is still a good card. And then the next guy I played against, um, it was it was a good game. He just bricked really badly, and I just took it all. Um, because of those two, I had the best. I had the best tiebreaker, so I had the best chance of making top eight if I didn't go X1. Oh, okay. Just okay. because of my loss. To okay. Rufus. Yeah. Okay, got you. So where, what were your exact matchups? Do you remember? Um, so round one, I played Tri, I played Cole. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> okay. Okay. No, another uh, Red red Deer. Uh, round two, yep. feature match uh, against Salad. Yep. I win that one 2 1. Yep. Uh, round three, I played like. What did I play for round three? I'm very sorry, my round three opponent, if you're watching this. Um. Oh, I played uh, I played flu, and then I played round four a mirror a mirror match. Okay. Oh no, sorry, I played the mirror match. Yep. Uh, I was against um, <laughs> it was against third place uh, Evan. You'll see his, his profile. He also sword sold, but oh, okay. He just says I like, giga cap giga skill capped him, which <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Um, his only loss was me. Oh, okay. He won the Swiss. Okay. Um, and then I played against Flu. Um, he bricked really bad the game one, he had nothing, and then I just killed him. Yep. In game two, he had some plays, but I said droplet. Oh, okay. And then game three, or sorry, match, and then, so it was Flu, and then it was Sword Soul against uh, Rufus, lost yep. that one. Then round five, I did um, against the DPE, like one card fusion deck. Yeah. Uh, Spencer, he beat me, and then round six, uh, seven, the last, only round I actually prepared for, because I only expected to play Despia, was Despia and beat it. Oh, really? You only played one Despia one. matchup the whole, the whole I mean, evening? Like, I played, hey? like, branded against Spencer, but, like, was fusion. It was branded fusion, so that was it. Oh, like, okay, it wasn't, gotcha. Like, branded the deck. Gotcha. It wasn't like that, the pure deck. Okay, yeah. okay, awesome, awesome. Uh, anybody that you want to shout out at all? Yeah, absolutely. So, shout out to TGK, the game night. Shout out to you guys for, like, always watching our uh, profiles and stuff. Shout out to Common Box Games for their excellent uh, venue and, like, staff and yeah, everything. Yes, the venue and everything. The event was great. It was one of their first ones, and yeah, they handled it really, really well. Yeah, uh, shout out to the Red Deer crew. Uh, five of us got top 32, uh, which is excellent. Out of the nine that went, like, that's a really good record. Uh, Red Deer trying to take over. And then, you know, shout out to, uh, of course, uh, you know, Papa Titan. If without him, we wouldn't have this uh, channel. And, uh, you know, shout out to my buddies here at Locals for always playing with me. Oh, well, well, well thanks, Prophet. I appreciate Absolutely. that. Alrighty, man. You want to get off into the deck let's profile right here? Let, 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 let's see what you're playing here. So, free Ecclesia. Yep. Three mel. Yep. Three long. Yep. And then I play two. Yep. Um, going forward, I think I'm gonna cut this to one just because I didn't see it ever come up. Okay. So these are standard. And then I played one Shunjin. Oh, okay. So you played the auspicious beast as they called it in the OCG. How did right. how did this fare to so uh, in the this region? out token collector, this and any level one tuner just outs the token collector. So you always so if you special any of them, you just tribute the tokens, then you have another monster, and you can just go battle, attack over their token collector, and keep playing. So oh, if you have to, okay. You have to give a battle, but you don't need to kill them with this deck. So it's good going second, going first, not so much. Okay. I keep it. Okay. That's yeah. pretty spice. That's pretty spice. And then of course. Three Shuna. Yep. I played two at Hara. Kind of oh, okay. regret it, but so would you? So yeah, you would play I, a third one. Yeah, I changed this to three two. Okay, and gotcha. then I played two water. Um, okay, I'm gonna probably change that as well. What do you? The third vessel. Oh, okay, gotcha. So you're cutting one just for another vessel. Yeah. Okay, it's a good, it's a good monster trap, but okay. not so much. Okay, and then one Odo. 
How did, how did the Odo perform? Didn't see it at all, but I wish I did. Yeah? Uh, it's a good little six tuner just to send a worm to the grave and then you special it. Yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah, it's a great extender. And then you synchro with it into Chen Ying and then you banish a card because this gets banished when it leaves the field, so yeah. the card was banished. Yep. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, that's it for the main worms. Okay. And I played three Ash, three Veiler. Okay. And that was it. Okay. And uh, how did the Veiler do like versus, like say, the Imperm? Disgusting. <laughs> yeah? Normal summon, synchro, level eight, level seven. Okay. Really good. Okay. I have a feeling there's going to be another card in this deck that uh, you know might also. You'll also see why. I didn't see why. Valor yeah. Another card. So yeah. Why, I'm on Imper three, why Valor instead of Imperm? Two. Yep. Okay, so you two. Oh, okay, gotcha. So, so you'd play that third vessel. Good instead. going second, good going first. I want to see this every time, so yep. I would change that around. Gotcha, gotcha. And then, of course, I went two tactics, because yep. it's just really good this format. Okay. Two pot, because thank God pot's back at two. Yes, yes. Um, and then I played, the I played this, Flawless oh, Perfection. Oh, Flawless Perfection. Okay, that's really spicy. So I played this before, but the main reason is because Token Collector, this just gives me pot agree. They can't be destroyed by card effects, aren't affected by them. All face not effect monsters. Oh, it's really okay. good. So if I draw, and then I pot agree. So if I draw the uh, if I draw Imperm on their turn, yep. and I have cards, it's dead. Gotcha, so I draw gotcha. That Gotcha. And then I played one uh, Reborn, because yep. you need to. It's really good. Yep. Some people don't, but you don't have to. And then I played four God cards going second. Okay. The three did, Droplet, and then the one Call How did the Droplet perform? Just considering Against that... Salad, it sucks, but otherwise it's pretty good. Yeah? Yeah, 100%. I negated, like, Ryza. For turn oh, against the okay. player, yeah, gotcha, out. and then gotcha. of course the, just one blackout. Oh, okay, the one, just the one blackout. Yeah, main deck's forty-eight. Okay, the uh, the extra, so three monk, one shaman. And okay, then I played yeah. one Drago master. This did come up against my sorcerer mirror, but he had droplet. Otherwise, I was gonna out his entire board. Oh, really? Put Baron in defense. Okay, because I made him go first. Yeah, that's actually decent. Yeah. yeah. So that's it for the links, and then my Yang Zing package. Another one. I was really excited to see if I could build the piece. Very standard. Yep. One Yazi, two Boxia, yeah. Chao Fang. Yep. Pretty standard. And then the Sword Soul parts. Got to play in there just two. Yep. Yep. And then lastly, the last 10 and 8. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yep. Just very standard. Yeah. Um, really, really standard. Your flex yep. spot is, of course, that Draco Master. But other than that, like, I wouldn't change anything in this, extra, this side deck. Yeah. Maybe Draco Master, but that's it. Okay. Then my side deck, so my five going first cards. Floodgate dot deck. I do want a third one, but I didn't have it at the time. Yeah, absolutely disgusting. Like anti spell just like blows people out of the game. Yeah. yeah. You, did you resolve rivalry a couple of I times? I resolved all, almost every time I saw it. It was good. Yeah. yeah. That's amazing. And then going second, it was for trap specific hate. Oh, gotcha. Um, I just preferred this over because I don't need to kill my opponent. I just prefer this over uh, lightning storm. Yep. So I just played that, and then like if they had anything. I would just red reboot it. Like yeah. If they had any trap, like red reboot, anti spell, or blackout, I just win the game. Yeah. Yeah. And then three crow, one change of heart. Oh yeah, crow is yeah, crow is so really good this format. The three behind the change of heart is because Draco Master just says two monsters plus a link. Yeah. So if I take a link monster and just link off with anything, I now have this, and he's just a free pop. Yes, yeah, because I uh, I was actually, uh, you uh, you actually played a feature match at the regional, did. didn't you? Yeah, so yeah. I, I kind of, I was actually at the table right beside the, the commentary table, and I was kind of right. overhearing um, just like how they were just talking about Change of Heart and how they felt about the card. Yeah. And uh, yeah, they were saying that it's not great in Sword Souls just because there's not really anything you can do with it, but no. the Draco Masters, that actually, yeah, that, that makes main, sense. That was the main theory behind it. Yeah. Um, it's good in the mirror. It breaks the mirror. Um, it breaks open lots of like other links that go in a lot of monsters. Yeah. So that was it. Um, 15 card, 15 card side. There's some things I would change, but I'm not sure what yet. I have to do some more testing, but yeah, we... Uh, we got the mat, boys. It was excellent. It was a really a lot of fun. Um, we hope to top more regionals, and we hope to, you know, see you guys there. We have a hopefully check out the vlog video because it'll be coming up first. Yes, absolutely. And, um, yeah, yeah. Leave comments. You know, letting me know what you guys think. Uh, there are some things I'm changing for sure, and you'll see some spicy sword soul going forward. Awesome, awesome. Well, thank you so much, Chris. Thank you so much, Profit. Congratulations again on making the top eight and getting this beautiful Exo Sister Regional mat. It is absolutely beautiful. Remember, guys, like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. If you like what's going on here at the Game Nights, you can give us a follow on Facebook, share the video, hit that noti bell, all that good stuff. You'll definitely be seeing more of us. And don't forget, guys, we are going to be doing some more giveaways, so make sure that you are commenting on the videos as well, like Prophet said. 
And uh, yeah, guys, we will see you in the next one. Deuces Profit.